Hello again. Uh, I wanted to put a very short and uh, pithy, my favorite word, uh, video um, online this morning um, in response to an article by uh, Chris Patton, now Lord Patton of Barnes. Uh, let's not get into my views about uh, the unelected House of Lords. Um, in response to an article um, he wrote, uh, it was published in The Guardian uh, yesterday, late yesterday, um, in which he essentially made the point that um, in response to the uh, protests uh, and deep opposition uh, to the proposed amendments to Hong Kong's extradition laws, um, that Britain should intervene on Hong Kong's behalf. Um, and is honor, honor bound to do so um, as the former sovereign power. Um, I agree. I'm not uh, making any arguments. Uh, as I've made clear in the past, I'm not making any arguments about uh, Chinese sovereignty of Hong Kong. It, it is a fact. Um, it is an undisputable fact. Um, but he makes the point that as the former sovereign power, Britain is on the ground to at least speak out in the best interests of Hong Kong. Um, as a matter of honor, as a matter of principle. I couldn't agree more. However, it's not going to happen. And I'm going to tell you why. Because Britain has no honor. Britain is only willing to sell its honor to the highest bidder, and it always has done. Um, the British Empire, um, another stain on the national conscience of the British, um, was never an empire built upon a desire for territorial conquest or political hegemony. It was an empire built on cold, hard cash and greed. The capitalist system itself, uh, which Britain is such an important player in building, is a system based upon greed and the acquisitive desire that's such a, an essential part of the human condition. And Britain desperately needs, desperately needs that big, fat, juicy trade deal with China that it's going to need along with the other big, fat, juicy trade deals to replace the current perfect deal it had with the European Union as a member of the Single Market and Customs Union. So, to the people of Hong Kong, I again apologize, as I did yesterday, uh, for the legacy of colonialism that you have to live with now. And to Lord Patton of Barnes, I say, be realistic, man. You know Britain's not going to stand up and be counted and make anything other than token statements because the only thing the British government cares about is that big, fat, juicy trade deal. And it's not going to get it if it voices any real opposition or takes a stand on any issue against China. So, the honour's on the table. The honour's for sale to the highest bidder. Whoever wants it, whatever you want, the British will sell it to you. Okay, a very short and pithy video for today. Uh, I'm not going to say anything more. Um, my next post uh, will be coming soon, and I haven't decided on the topic yet. It may be more of the same. Let's see what happens. Peace.